What's going on guys? Awesome back and today I'm going to be showing you everything that I bought on my shopping spree on the R6 marketplace. Now as I'm recording this, this is actually during the beta so it's actually not out yet. This is still I'm in season uh, one right now, not season two or Operation New Blood. So this is in the beta. But yeah, I'm going to be showing you guys everything that I bought with a fat shopping spree. I spent a little bit more than I should have probably but this thing is so addicting. I swear. So yeah, I'm going to be showing you everything um, in the first portion of this video right after I'm going to be cutting to the actual R6 marketplace to show you guys what I got, how many credits it was and stuff like that. So in the names and stuff like that, so you can, you know, look them up for yourself, go cop some stuff. And then in the second part of this video, I'm going to be showing you guys what it actually looks like in game. So you guys can get a better idea before you actually go buy this stuff and things like that. So yeah, let's get right into this video and yeah. All right, so we are now over on to the actual R6 marketplace. Like I was saying, it is still in beta from when I'm recording this video. But yeah, let's get into the transactions. Like, ignore this. But yeah, first up, I just bought this one like two hours ago. Little scarecrow thing. This goes with the headgear that I got. 220 is a lot for this, and it's not even, I don't think, that tough. But we need you need to match, man. You need the combos. Um, next up, we got this little bandit uniform. Looks okay. Looks really nice. Just under 400. There's gonna be a lot of this pro league stuff. I just love the gold, black, and white. Such clean colors, man. Seriously. Um, but yeah, we copped that. Um, then we got this little smoke uniform headgear, a little like USA coloring circus stuff. Um, looks really nice with the white gloves. This is for smoke. Don't run a lot of smoke, but had to get some drip for them. Um, and then we got this a little beach trip seasonal. Not my favorite, but um, this is really clean, honestly. A little in it's two hundred. So if you need like a little cheap, little seasonal uni universal skin, beach trip is probably your way to go um then i'm gonna tell you guys i got a lot of operator portraits so i'll probably just tell you who they are not really go much into depth this is gonna be for fuse um and then we got this jackal headgear 150 for this love this thing <laughs> super funny nice skin um and then we got this nice little one for warden for only 120 here actually so good snag for there we also got this mozzie headgear for 120 to go with this uniform that i'm about to show you that i got in a second um, and then we got this clash, uh, low pro league thing for 120. I try to get drip for everybody, even the people that I don't run. So you'll, you'll, you'll probably, I'll probably tell you guys who I don't really run, but don't really run clash. Got this for 120. Don't even run cav really, but I got this little clean set for 240. Really good snag there. I'm not going to lie. This is, looks really good in game. Um, and then maestro here, you can see, I got this for 140 with this for 120. This is both run Goku, I think, or this might be showdown. This might be run Goku really clean set for maestro the uniform and like the black stuff the black uh sleeves looks really nice then there's this mozzie uniform only 120 for this man really surprised me that it was that cheap but really great snag there um then we got this sledge low pro league thing 120 need some for sledge and the gold looks really nice on that um and then i bought this headgear but i'm not going to use it doesn't look good with the uniform that i got but so we'll just discard that um, and then this is the big thing that I got actually. Well, my black guy or well, my glacier, man, this is going to get you play. If you do not get play, this will get you play. This is 20,000 credits. This thing's going for 30,000. I got it for 20,000. Might get the thermite one. Be, we'll see how much I actually really like this warden. Uh, this one, my thing as I use it. But yeah, this thing is clean, man. You'll see it later in game. And then I had to get the uniform for him. 900. To go, I got this little, little, on like a little $200 discount, but or 200 credit discount jesus um but really clean one for him pro league um and then this osa little bundle for 240 looks really nice her hair like on the normal uh headgears looks so ugly so i had to get the hat on her and then i got this uh thing for glass literally just matches the headgear i have on him nothing nothing much there this little basic zero uh headgear and then we got this clean this is one of my favorite like 240 for this nice skin you'll see it in game later in this video but this is really clean bro you got to go get this if you run flores and then we got this little combo for cade with the um i i, I forget i think this is doctor's curse headgear for only 200 and then we got another pro league skin this looks really nice together and then you can see this pro league alibi headgear that we got plus it's gonna go with this uh uniform i got i spent like 500 on alibi and i don't even use alibi but it's clean bro you need the drip and then we got tachanka speaking of not using tachanka headgear this thing's pretty clean um and then this i'm telling you bro this is 340 credits one of the best skins in the game in headgears 
for cap can the black is so tough with the skeleton bro you gotta go cop that if you run cap can at all bro it's 300 for that and then obviously we're gonna have some operator portraits here that we copped um looks really nice so smoke blackbeard nook pulse twitch um some glaciers i was trying to buy um what else we got here a twitch headgear uniform this one was a little pricey 350 but looks really nice in game um and then this vigil headgear is one of my favorites that i got looks really clean 470 but it's really tough um and then the normal like thunderbird thing is so ugly so i had to copy uniform for her um and then we got this zofia you know uh uniform headgear this thing looks really tough in game 360 i don't even run her but it is really tough for ella all right so then next this is my second biggest purchase that i got um we got the crossfader this thing is tough bro looks so good on guns like r4c azami's smg so tough on it trust 550 for that this goes for like 7,000 now but yeah next we're gonna have this uh oriex headgear that i got 120 this was a big snag um and then we have cop this ella and jackal black ice super cheap i said i was gonna buy primary black ices and just try to pull the rest but these are really cheap i don't even know why i bought them really but 129 for a black ice bro and this is like one of the best in the game uh we got these two headgears must buys in my opinion 400 for this one really pretty expensive but this mute one just looks awesome and it's only 150 highly recommend that this headgear for montane looks really sweet in game had to get it with the uniform only 120 then we got some more operator portraits belk mozzie and this is blitz blitz once has so much aura some dokabi skins this is, was a lot i don't even run dokabi but this is such a tough combo and then we got like the c3po lion headgear absolutely love that one um only 120 moving on to the next page we got um thorn operator portrait this one for thatcher is really nice it's uniform really love this one shows like his bare hands looks really nice in game then this is my favorite seasonal i got probably other than crossfader this waffle cone looks one looks dope it's only i only got it for 360 it'll probably be under like 500 right now but this is probably my favorite i would really suggest this one if you guys are looking for like a universal one that's cheap um and then we got like the gat eyes thermite this goes for like 120 got on a little bit of a discount looks really nice in game I would this is a must buy i think for anybody that runs thermite um and then this awesome like velt combo i got um this obviously the white uniform and then this awesome headgear bro this looks sick in game i will tell you if you run belk you need to be getting this bro and then next up we have this operator portrait for jackal looks pretty nice 200 though um this so this is uh, attachment skin i was gonna get for this universal skin that down here but this is actually only zofia i guess so we're just gonna sell this this headgear, one of my favorites that I actually got. This thing looks sick on Finca. This is, I think, a must-buy for anybody that runs Finca, even though it's 700. Um, we got this Warden Operator Portrait, only 120. And then this other seasonal skin, this is the last one I got. Um, it's kind of sick, 350. Um, I'd definitely suggest the Waffle Cone over it, but this is a pretty clean one. Um, this Team Empire R4C skin, which looks pretty tough. Um only 340 didn't want to get pina colada like everybody else um and then search and rescue attachment skin looks uh pretty tough three or 739 here it goes for like a thousand then we got this tachanka uniform this visual operator portrait maestro operator portrait this is uh why can i think of the name um i tachanka this is tachanka operator portrait um and then this cav one's clean and then we got this skin this is one of my favorites i'm not gonna lie this thing is so clean 120 for this thing if you run buck at all get this skin with search and rescue this thing is one of the best in the game trust then we got this skin for the kate smg and then this one looks really nice if i didn't have crossfade i'd be running this on every single uh this is for like the smg for uh cap can and azami and tachanka this thing is so awesome with search and rescue um and then the last couple items we have here this is gonna be the operator portrait for cap can um this skin for the mpx pretty tough skin not gonna lie probably wouldn't spend 300 on it but it is pretty tough then we got this skin for the t or uh lesions gun uh this thing is sweet i'm not gonna lie red attachment skin white attachment skin whatever this is tough for only 200 bro cop this thing um then we got operator portrait for Oriex, Operator Portrait for Rook, uh, Operator Portrait for Thunderbird, Ella, and then Kapatau. 
um and then we got this 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 background this thing is 800 like what i got it for this thing goes for like 2000 now so i wouldn't spend that much on a background but if you're gonna buy a background for that much this one is so good it looks good with like every skin um but yeah i love that thing and then actually the last thing or this is like the first thing i bought but the last thing i'm showing you guys is this ying headgear man this thing looks so tough on my chung lee um bundle but yeah that is that is that is it that's everything that i got um we'll now hop on to the ps5 the playstation and i will show you what all these things look like in game all right so we are back on the playstation i'm gonna be showing you guys what everything looks like we're gonna go through like the uniforms and all that stuff and then we will go through the skins after and like the shooting range so let's just go quickly into it so you guys can see um obviously this is the first thing the sledge uniform i think it looks really clean especially this is just the normal headgear that i have on but it looks really tough. I really like the gold on it. Um, really good skin to get. Um, and then next we have um, the Thatcher uniform. Really like this one. It looks really good with this headgear. Um, I guess this was the 2019 collection, but really looks nice. I really love this one. Um, looks good in game. Um, and then also I can show you the crossfader actually real quick. I have this on the R4C. Really nice, bro. This thing is really freaking nice. Um, and then we get, we got the, the the Thatcher headgear. Freaking love this thing, bro. Look at this. Like it just looks it just looks funny. It just looks awesome. Huge ass eyes. But yeah, great one. Um next up we have Twitch. I really love this. It looks really clean, I'm not gonna lie. Um if we go here, obviously this is I guess showdown and apocalypse. Apocalypse. I thought these were the same collection, but I guess not. Looks really nice. And then this is what the actual portrait looks like. I have this on like the blast um weapon background but yeah rengoku one there looks really nice next up we got montane with the full thing this is the headgear and all of that quick one you guys have probably seen that one a lot um and then this is what the glass uniform looks like the like green one that i got looks really nice with this headgear actually just matches the colors um and then we got fuse up next which i think we had the background looks really nice with the blast one again really highly recommend that one um <clears throat> blitz this background looks sick. I can also show you, you know, the pink one here. Um, we'll get through that. But yeah, this one looks really nice. A lot of aura on that guy right there. And then this is what the actual six major thing looks like. It looks really nice. I'm not going to lie. Um, IQ. I don't think I had anything for IQ. Buck. Here, I'll show you the actual. Or actually, we're doing skins after. So I'll, I lied to you guys. We'll show that in a minute. Um, this is what the Blackbeard Alberta portrait looks like looks pretty tough um next up we got yeah did i get anything for Zap capital I, I think i got the operator portrait looks really nice uh i i like the normal one but i think this one looks really dope with like the armor and stuff um i don't think any i didn't get anything for abana <laughs> the jackal headgear bro shouts like this thing just looks awesome bro i'm not gonna i can't even lie look at this man looks awesome it was cheap too and then this is what the background actually looks like in game um i just have it on the pink um one and then this is the yang headgear tell me this is not clean bro you cannot tell me this is not clean look at this looks great with the chung lee it'll look good with a lot of other ones too uh zofia i didn't get anything for zofia um dokabi like look at this combo man this thing looks awesome um the pants are a little a little weird but uh, this thing looks dope regardless need that on dokabi and then this is the actual this is the lion headgear i freaking love this thing like look at this man it looks awesome it looks like c3po but yeah on the finca like oh this is what i'm talking about but this headgear is tough especially with this uniform you can find this one for pretty cheap too probably like 200 but yeah this headgear is awesome if you are a finca main um we got maverick i didn't get anything for nomad i didn't get anything for uh no it's nothing for gridlock uh here and then we got this nook operative portrait looks awesome bro i think this one looks cool but like oh this one is tough it is tough must must cop there um i didn't get anything for ayana uh not a lot of attackers here's that um zero headgear i got doesn't really look much different than like the default one um here's the flores uniform this one looks really awesome i just love how this way this thing looks plus with the mirage um gun skin this thing looks clean 
clean Osa. Um, got the crossfade on this one and really goes with the uniform. Obviously, it doesn't match like perfectly, but it looks a lot better than what I was talking about with like the hair. Bro, I hate this. The, the cap is so much better. Can't even lie. Cannot even lie. Um, and I think that's it here. Uh, did we miss any like portraits? I don't think we did. But yeah, that is going to be it for the attacker side. Um, and I bought a lot of more things for the defense. So here is this uniform. Looks pretty clean. I really like the white gloves. Um, it's just like pretty sleek. You know what I mean? Little carnival, red, white, and blue. Little thing there for my boy Smoke. Um, and then we got the mute headgear. This thing is clean, bro. I got this with the elite, obviously, but this thing is tough. Uh, next up, we got the castle headgear. This thing was like 400, but it is well worth it. Look at that, bro. Looks so good with this uniform. Um, and then we got the pulse, which we actually got the little operator portrait. This thing looks dope from the Hot Doctor's Curse Halloween event. Um, moving to Doc, didn't get anything for Doc here. Oh, we got this for Rook. I got a lot of operator portraits for the defensive side. This one is clean. This is one of my favorites. I don't run Rook, but this shit is tough. Goes great with that uh, pink background. Um, and then here, the crossfade. I'm telling you, the guys, this looks so good on the Azami gun. You can see the purple. And then this is the actual uniform um, for Capcan. This thing is awesome. I love this thing. Like, look at it, man. Looks awesome. And it's cheap, too. It's like 300 for that whole thing. Tachanka with the drip here. Love this. Looks super clean. And then we got the operator portrait, which I do really like this one. Um, I really like the silver on that moving i didn't get anything for jagger here's the bandit uniform uh looks pretty good with the uh headgear like i was talking about um but yeah really clean and then obviously we have the g2 uh weapon skin which is absolutely sick um moving on nothing for frost oh here is the fully fledged uh velk skin this thing is tough all white the the headgear is just awesome bro one of my favorite headgears in the game. That and like the Finca and Thermite and all the Halloween ones are absolutely awesome. But yeah, and then we have the portrait, which this is one of my favorite portraits too. Like the wind, like everything. This one looks absolutely sick. Velk. I I play a lot of Velk, so having that Velk drip is key. Um, and then this nice little cab um skin and uniform is nice. Uh who else do we got here? um ella this is the ella um little skin that we got uh pretty cheap one looks really good and then you can see the search and rescue with the weapon skin um here is the vigil headgear looks really nice i actually didn't even throw on the um the scarecrow uniform so this is what it looks like now really tough looks really nice um and then maestro this one's really tough i really like the black on him um plus Obviously, there's the operator portrait. Looks pretty sweet. Alibi, I'm telling you, this thing looks awesome with the waffle cone skin. Really like this alibi one for anybody that runs alibi. Um, and then the clash one. This is just pretty clean. Again, with the waffle cone. Uh, K, this is one of my favorite ones. They had to upgrade the drip. Um, this is just tough. Plus, oh wait, I didn't get a portrait there, but really tough one here. Mozzie just looks really awesome, bro. I, like, the headgear doesn't really, like, match color-wise, but I think it still looks really good with this uniform. Um, and then, oh, yeah, we did get the operator portrait for this. Well, probably the least favorite operator portrait I got, but still needed it. I think this one's pretty tough, but we're just gonna rock with the portrait that we got. Um, Warden headgear, this thing looks dope. Like, you cannot tell me that is not tough. Plus, the matching little thing here, uh, operator portrait that we got for him really one of my favorites here um and then we got one my with his drip on uh love this uniform just all black so nice for him um i keep actually going out but here is Cade or not Cade jesus oriex looks really nice with the headgear plus we have the um weapon skin that we got uh malusi didn't get anything there Thunderbird, here we go. Really nice headgear again. I just hate this normal one that she has. It's just so butt, so had to cop that. Plus, I love this operator portrait for her. It looks really great with the blast background. Um, Thorn background looks really nice with that W7M background. Um, and then crossfade on that gun again. Looks awesome. I, did, I didn't buy this from the marketplace, but I got this Solus thing. Tough. Um, and yeah, that's it, man. That looks like to be it on the operator side actually i missed a couple operator portraits i missed this ella one toff looks great with the pink 
Um, this vigil one looks really sweet with the pink. Um, and then who else did I miss? I missed this cav one. This cav one looks really great. That is the um, Chung Li background. So yeah, that is going to be it for the skins. Let's hop into the weapon skins. All right, so for the first skin we got, we have the search and rescue attachment skin with this northern lights uniform or weapon skin for buck this thing looks absolutely sick again i love this combo it looks really nice on him as you can see in this light obviously it is only a blue skin so it is you know not the best but this thing looks absolutely sick and i would really suggest this one next up we have the jackal um black ice this thing looks awesome uh just one of the better black ices in the game i i would say um, this thing is awesome looks great with the white attachment skin um and then we'll take a quick look at this is the um this is the one like glistening like 300 seasonal i forgot the actual name of it but this thing looks really nice i have this on a lot of my secondary guns but yeah look at this thing uh, a little shiny i don't really run this on a lot of primaries but again with the search and rescue this thing looks sick so this is going to be the parabellum like 2022 i think skin for capcan tashanka a zombie this thing looks awesome this is again with the search and rescue um attachment skin but look at this thing man it looks sweet the coloring is really nice the blue with the pink background this thing looks awesome i'm not even gonna lie if i didn't have crossfade i'd probably be running this on like every every uh, like all of them but yeah this is going to be one of the better ones i think all right then next up we have the ella black ice i think this thing looks sick i think i'm gonna chuck the um white attachment skin on this i think this it would look a lot cleaner with that but this is one of the cleaner again black ices in the game i believe um but yeah that is ella black ice and then next up we have alibi with our waffle cone this thing is clean bro the colors are really nice um and then you get to get that like blue when you reload but yeah man this is awesome i think this is one of the most underrated ones that you can actually get um but yeah i would definitely be paying like 250 credits for this any day of the week one of the best seasonals in the game and then next up we got the big boy glacier for the mp5k this thing is clean man this thing is clean again i might cop the thermite one but i really love this looks great with the white attachment this thing is definitely going to get you like mad women. I'm not going to lie if you have one of these. This is going to be the like Teddy Showdown whatever skin for uh, Cade. Looks really nice with the white attachment skin. You can go pink with this, but not much to say with this, but it is pretty clean. And then next here we have the crossfade. Um, obviously, this is, goes on a lot of different guns, but this looks, I think, the most clean on a zombie in this uh, SMG. Just look at it with the pink and the purple you can see. Just looks so nice, man. I love this skin. I'm so glad I got it. The pink when you reload. But yeah, this is, one the, this is Keep probably my it. favorite other than the Glacier. And then next up, we have this R4C Team Empire skin. This thing is really clean. This is with the red attachment skin on it. Um, but this thing looks absolutely sick. I would definitely suggest this if you are trying to get all 4C skin on the budget. And then last but not least, we have the like sand beach seasonal skin. This thing is pretty clean. I would say it's not as nice as the waffle cone, but this thing still looks really heat. Um, if you need a skin like this, good for the secondary guns. But yeah, that is going to be the last skin we're going to take a look at. But yeah, that's going to be all for today's video. If you guys enjoyed watching this video, make sure you hit the like and subscribe button down below. Um, and my Twitch is also in the description if you ever want to pop by. I stream most nights over there on the twitch.tv. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit those stuff and do those things. Um, I hope you enjoyed. Um, let me know if you end up liking any of these skins. If you end up copying any of these skins for yourself, I would like to know. And if you have any suggestions on what skins I should get with this remaining 4K. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.